Welcome everyone on a perfect night for football with the floodlights beaming down. My name is Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry and sitting next to me, ready to give you all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. And without doubt, a match with the potential to bring genuine excitement. It's Portugal taking on Real Madrid. Thanks Derek as always, this should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium, we've got two teams full of quality, it's an interesting matchup and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? And the contest begins. Here's how it looks for Portugal. Well, in this 4-5-1, they're packing their midfield, but the two wide players will almost play as out-and-out -out wingers. However, it's important they do get runners from central areas to support... Oh, Stuart, they might be onto something here. And a goal! To open the scoring, a very bright start to this one. Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. One nil then. Vinicius Junior. Otavio now. Very quick thinking there. Mbappe. Wasteful from Portugal. Vinicius. Inacio. And back to the keeper. So plenty of forward momentum from Real Madrid here. And just missing the target. Well, they're at least making chances. Now they need to be more clinical. Well, that was a chance. And Ancelotti will be so frustrated they aren't level now. And Diogo Costa has it now. Now options are plenty. And that'll be offside. Sloppy in possession from Portugal. Chances on. Oh, he saved it well. Bruno Fernandes has it. Cristiano Ronaldo. This could be troublesome. Genuine chance. A magnificent stop. Well, it should be a goal, but take nothing away from the keeper. That's a brilliant save. Oh, he's lost possession of the ball. Palinha. Bernardo Silva. Electing to shoot. Stopped a surefire goal. Clear foul, but a Real Madrid advantage. Promising looking attack. Vinicius Jr. Straight forward for the keeper. And play halted, free kick given.
Bernardo Silva. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Chance for Bernardo Silva. Really high class goalkeeping from Courtois. <laughs> Using his physical strength to shield it. Well, sadly, they just couldn't keep possession. How could he take them on and beat them? Promising looking ball. Ronaldo. Ball is loose. Well, thank goodness for the goalkeeper. Well, they're calm now, but that initial save was absolutely magnificent. Mendy. Uh, good work from Portugal to win it back. Inacio. And it's Ruben Dias. Well, possession is the watchword inside their own territory. Leal. Given away by Real Madrid. And teammates around him. Foiling his opponent completely. Well, it looked so promising, but a goal kicked the outcome. Well, Portugal have certainly controlled the possession in the last 15 minutes, creating lots of chances now, and you think if they do get another, it's going to be tough for the opposition to find a way back into this. Modric. And Bellingham. Mendy. Mendy. Well, here it is again. Just look at the quality of the cross. It's inch perfect, but you do have to ask questions of the keeper. Could he have done better here? I think so. You can't be beaten at your near post like that. Back underway. Level pegging. One goal apiece in this game. Otavio. Well, not giving him any breathing room. It's a splendid run by Mbappe. Well, it really looked as though that was going to be another goal from him. Well, a chance for his second there. Probably should have done a bit better there, really. Palinha. Well, this is looking promising. Ah, well, fair enough. That's a good recovery. Not a huge chunk of added time. One minute. Out of play. Real Madrid throw here. Modric. Mbappe. So the whistle then. We're up the halfway stage in this match. Well, the verdict on Kylian Mbappe. In a word, positive. Well, he certainly got his team back into this game with that goal because up to that point, they hadn't played particularly well. I think he's had a decent first half, but he'll be looking to build on his goal in the second 45. And so the second half gets underway. Almost a case of the two teams saying to each other, whatever you can do, I can do just as well. Rodrigo, can they nudge in front and did just enough defensively? Gonzalo Inacio. And the referee takes exception to the challenge, free kick.
Oh, great vision. Possession one. What can Real do from this position? Well, no problems defensively. Now, options are plenty. Bruno Fernandes has it. Difficult to stop him. Well, he's given us away. Carvajal. And the cross smuggled away. Well, she was hoping perhaps not to have to blow the whistle, but in the end it will be a free kick. And he takes it on! Well, in truth, it could have been more challenging for the goalkeeper. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Rafael Leao. He's going forward well here. Oh, he's left his marker for dead. Well, just the tackle that was needed. Carvajal. Fine work from Portugal to win back possession. Diogo Dallo. Otavio now. Bruno Fernandes has it. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Carvajal. Rudiger. Here's Carvajal. Rudiger has it. And he did well to cut it out. Good ball over the top. Ronaldo. That's a foul, and it will be a potentially dangerous free kick. Well, they've decided to make a change. on the target but the keeper up to the task of saving it well you can't argue with those stats can you they've had good chances at both ends the game is being played with great intensity and it's been a pleasure to watch and it will be a free kick to Real Madrid well Real Madrid are going to make the change now Well, there's a really stylish piece of running. Mbappe 
Can they forge ahead? They do! And you've got to say, they're good value for the lead. Well, just look at his movement. He knows exactly how to find space. And it's also a tidy finish. That's a nice goal. Well, just look at his reaction. That could prove to be a massive goal for his team. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? He has teammates around him. Vinicius Jr. Really vital interception. Palinha. Diogo Dallo on the ball. And Palinha with it. Ten minutes to go then. Real Madrid doing well to regain possession here. Wonderful chance! Able to close down the shot. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. Corner kick played in. Danger still on. Decent position. Rodrigo. Oh, what a clearance under pressure. Had to react and did. Well, the players should be inspired by this. The crowd have really got behind them today. Well, it comes down to the final five minutes. Diaz, Ruben Neves, Bruno Fernandes has it, and it's Ruben Diaz, really good challenge, Kylian Mbappe, and they're still in with a shot, thanks to the keeper just then. Well, that's a really important save, but can they get back into this match? I'm not sure they can. And he's fired over the corner. The clearance wasn't decisive. Stopped a surefire goal. Diogo Dallo. And Palinha with it. Gonzalo Inacio. Carvajal. Rodrigo. Promising pass. And Bellingham. And that is that. The end of the game. It goes into the books as a win for Real Madrid. What did you think of their overall performance? Well, Derek, it was very competitive. Chances at both ends, but I feel they were the better team and they deserve their victory. Well, just the sort of performance they were looking for from the talented Kylian Mbappe. Well, he looked a top-class player today. Every time he touched the ball, he was a threat. And he worked so hard for the team as well. What a good display that was. Dia após outro dia e mais uma noite no meio.